Well, I've done polls of groups where, uh, you know, before a talk, I want to know what people are struggling with. And I've asked them to rate their marriages. And this is in church groups. One group, it was a C plus. Another group, it was 5.5 out of 10. And the top issues that they're dealing with are lack of intimacy, feeling disconnected. But Paul tells us that without love, we're clanging gongs, we're crashing cymbals. And if we don't want God to be portrayed as indifferent, divisive, bitter, resentful, then maybe it's time for us to take some of that energy that's being focused into leadership and shift it into our marriage. Because your marriage may be the most vital gospel you ever preach. So how does the gospel of your marriage sound to you, to your spouse, to your kids? Because if the gospel doesn't sound like good news, it's not the gospel. And it's time. It's time for marriage to start sounding like good news.